Welcome to the five best youth basketball dribbling games here on the OzSwish YouTube channel. Number one, Caterpillar Dribbling. In this game, we have two teams lined up at the baseline, moving towards the halfway line. Players are equally distance apart in their team so that the back player can dribble through their teammates. Players work to dribble right hand going right and left hand going left, crossing the ball over. When they arrive at the front, they let the player at the back know that they can go. The players at the front do a jump or a stride stop, and the first team to the halfway line will win the game with a penalty for the losing team. Feel free to change up the crossover types. High five. This is a really fun drill to do as a warm up or to have players learn their names at the start of a season. Players start with two groups, one inside the half court, the other on the outside of the half court, dribbling in opposite directions. The inside players dribble on their inside hand and the outside players dribble on their outside hand. When the coaches says change, the players have to change direction. The goal here is that they high five each other as they pass each other and say each other's name so they avoid looking down as they dribble. Mortal Kombat. This is a competitive one-on-one -on -one dribbling knockout drill. Players are inside the jump ball circle here with the goal of a player to knock the other person's ball out of bounds with their non-dribble hand. When a ball gets knocked out of bounds, a new challenging player comes in. Players must keep their own score of how many basketballs they've knocked out of bounds. At the end of a set time, we have a winner with the highest score. Players cannot kick a ball or throw their ball at another person's ball to knock it out of bounds. Chip Shark Shaw. This is a fun listening and dribbling game, working on left and right hand dribbles. Here, the coach is barking instructions of where the athletes have to dribble. The middle of the court is called Ship, and the right hand side of the court is called Shark, and the left hand called Shaw. The last player to arrive at a line gets knocked out. Players must dribble left hand going left and right hand going right, and they must work to improve their reaction time so they don't get knocked out. Pokemon Tag. This is a fun competitive time drill where two teams are pitted against each other. One team is inside the three point line and the other team enters from the baseline. The goal of the baseline team is to tag everyone in the quickest amount of time. When a player gets tagged, they have to stand where they got tagged and the tagging player passes it to their next player in bounds. Players can use the players who are stuck as screens to avoid getting tagged. The quickest time wins, the goal being that you have to catch them all. Thanks for checking out this video. Please take time to hit the like and subscribe button and the notification bell to be advised when new videos are uploaded. I hope you had as much fun watching this as we did making it. Please check out our other videos. We'll see you in the next one.